Welcome and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to learn uh, the basic SQL commands like select, create, table, and all those. So let's just start. And we will, uh, it's a complete series of SQL commands. So we will see through all the basic commands and some of the interview questions that are being asked from for SQL queries. So let's just start. So first of all, we will start with our create command. We are going to try to create a table. Create table. Uh, this is the command and what we should provide a name of a table so let it be name b demo one and uh, now we have to provide the values so the id uh, we can take it as int uh, name we can take it as varchar we have to provide varchar is a variable character so we have to provide a size for it so let it be 20 and uh, i think city so varchar Five, I guess. So now just we have to hit enter, and our database is created. I am using uh, Oracle database. See, I am using this command from window only for your business purpose because it is much, it will uh, create some errors and it will help you to learn better. If you provide just some kind of ID directly, then it's not going to be that helpful because it will uh, provide inbuilt support and just drag and drops. You are not be able to learn queries properly. So we should just uh, see the table. So if we want to see the um, uh, structure, we should go for DSC that is to describe and table name that is demo one. So this is uh, this is going to describe the entire structure of the table. So here it is. So its ID is uh, name city. So Oracle is not uh, case sensitive. So whatever we provide the name in small capital small letters, we are getting it in capital. Okay. So now we should try to select. If you want to fetch data from our table, right now we don't have any kind of entry in our table, so if we try to fetch, we are going to get nothing. So we the syntax is select all. Uh, the star is used to represent all. Okay, so select all from the table name. So table name is demo one. And if we try to fetch, it is say that no rows selected, which really means that uh, right now no rows are present inside a table. So now we will insert some data inside our table. Uh, insert into the insert command is used to add data in the table so insert into table name that is demo1 and the values we can directly provide the values uh, conditions applied it must be in the same order so right now we just want that is first is the id then name then city so we just try to insert the data we will provide an id equal to 1 uh, the varchar value should be inside single quotes okay so name can be karthik and uh, city could be Gopal. Uh, so this is our data values one and uh, that is the id name and city we just try to insert it okay one row created which means the data has been inserted successfully now if you want to just see what is inserted we just write select all uh, from demo one so as we can see that the id is one name is karthik and city is Gopal. So finally we have inserted some kind of data in the data we will try to insert one more column so insert into demo one and today if now we will try one more method we will provide a first you going to enter the name so i have explicitly defined which type of value i'm going to insert then we will insert the city and then id and then we will going to provide the values now i have to write first the name so be akash uh, and then the city is amla and finally the id so now just try to insert so row is created and now if we try to fetch the data it will say that uh, you can see that id is its right place. so if we want to explicitly define uh, the data if we don't know the order in which the data the rows are inserted so we can just provide the row names so they are going to be in right order if the order is not same then it's going to give any type of error or something like that so I hope you are able to understand the select command, insert data table and insert uh, two types of data, two methods for inserting data, direct inserting the values and inserting the value by their names. We have also seen the select command. Uh, so thank you. If you like the video, please rate, comment, subscribe. In the next videos, we will see some more questions and queries.